This movie addresses the correct function of the little pink thingies underneath a brother lace carriage. We don't have a lot of lace carriage movies because the main adjustment that they require is really too finicky for most do-it-yourselfers to succeed at, but this should be something that you can address on your own. The issue under discussion is what these should feel like when you move them. Should they be stiff or should they be easy to move? We've heard from a friend who has one behaving in each way. All right, notice this pink section here. It's got a little spring right there. See it? I'm pulling it down. It's in a, it's in a little declivity in there. And there's a tang on the end of this where the spring sits. So if you push it, it'll pop right back out. All right. Now notice here, when that goes back against the spring pressure, it pulls out this stopper. And then in its relaxed position, the spring pushes it and there's no impediment to going right through there for a needle butt. So the needle butt goes right through here. The back section of the bed right here is where this goes. So that means the needle butts are coming right through here. So the needle butt gets to here. It presses this up to go by and that brings this up, which is part of the lace knitting because it impedes the, the needle here. So you've got needles in two positions. You've got needles out here and you have needles in here. So one's coming this way and one's coming this way. So this lifts this and diverts this needle butt. And it does the same thing from both directions. There's your other lever. So the needle butt comes past this. We have a friend who has a similar lace carriage. This is actually for the 892 and hers is the 890, but they're basically the same. And one of her pink things is very loose and the other is very stiff. Now, we aren't there to feel what seems loose and stiff to her. So, Jack will simply explain to you how they should be operating and what to look for. I think it could seem very loose if the spring were actually missing or detached, couldn't it? It could. You can't get that spring out of this little chamber that it's in without taking this out or taking this rail off. But this is correct. It should be just... The spring pushes it back, no matter what else you do, and the needle butt just lifts it as it goes by. That is correct. Quite stiff is incorrect. You see how I'm not applying very much pressure at all to get That's this a to bounce fingertip around. Fingertip action. Right, and it should be pushed by the spring to its unloaded position, but easily lifted when the needle butt goes by. So what would make it quite stiff? We're not there and we can't be sure, but... Okay, this slide is moved because there's a plate in there. Okay. And it has to move freely in order for this to come up. So if there's crud underneath there, if there's crud here or here, old grease. So this metal piece is all the way underneath here, underneath here, and it's actually the end of this piece, this cam that comes up. And this is a directional cam for the needles to follow. So when one needle butt comes through here, it lifts the cam and it should drop right back out of the way. That's the thing is these things need to drop right out of the way for the next needle butt to come through if there's not one back here. All right, this is with no needles in work at all, and you can hear it changing the directions of the cam. But now if you've got needles in two positions, you see how they got moved? And in real life, we wouldn't actually put three in a forward position because we don't make three transfers side by side in a single row. But that was working this upper position needle but it was working it according to those pink things in the back. That's how one of the functions of the lace carriage is to 
have one needle butt back here that's moving this and that affects the, the needle butt in the upper working position. So one of the reasons for this being so persnickety is timing is everything. One needle has to lift this while the other needle is affected by it at the exact same time. 